Hey guys, I'm here at Crate and Barrel on Route 17 in Paramus, and I just wanted to point out, this is one of the most beautiful stores, I've exteriors so far I've ever seen. Like this kind of reminds me of Beetlejuice, how they just built that outcropping off the house just to, for the sky to shine throughout through the opening. And that's the first time I've ever seen it anywhere, architecturally really. It's pretty awesome. You have all this beautiful grass around here. The pillars in front with like the louvers over the windows there in the distance. Can't wait to get inside and see what's going on. I see, get the season, uh, place to, to gather the, a season together. So hopefully they have a lot of decorations inside. It's probably gonna be mostly furniture, but you know, I really wanted to get you guys into Pretty much every store that has any type of decorations uh, for your parties, your holidays. So let's see what's going on inside here. I already see already that they have great table settings. And I love how they have the prices all out for us so we can read it. Cool wine carafe. Actually, I needed that. Bark pumpkins, rope pumpkins, really nice table here. This is like just my kind of style of uh, table. I, I don't really like the, the bench is cool, definitely, but I'm more of like a chair guy. But I always thought it looks great, like having the, the big family bench on the side of the table like that. Trying to look for a big price tag here for what the table goes for. This should be it. There you go, 2000 Sometimes it comes with the chairs, sometimes it doesn't. Let's see, it's solid oak. That's why it's so expensive. Uh, two leaves, good. Uh-huh. Seats up to eight. Really nice. I love this wine carafe here too. How cool is that? See how much that is. Look at these all white pumpkins and squashes here. It's really cool. This is made in Turkey. I don't see a price on it. Maybe it's in these lists here. Royer linen napkins, wine glass. Huh? Try to find out later. You have some of these baskets and they're giving you ideas with maybe this is wheat put it in there look at this piece it's really pretty that with this table here that's a, that's like uh, my ideal dining room set because i have light hardwood floors in my house so that would go perfect another natural wood table with the bench I wonder if these are like a conical, they put, they go on top of each other. Oh no. This is like solid marble. Again, no price on it, but it's probably listed here somewhere. There you go. 13 inch, it would be $90 and it's well worth it. I mean, that's, Solid marble, weighs like 40 pounds. Could barely lift it. Heading over here. I need a non-stick frying pan too. I don't know if you guys have done a lot of, we have a house in the Poconos and uh, for years. I mean, we got it when it was dirt cheap. But anyway, we, we do like uh, some, of the, some of the cooking in these cast iron pots. You just don't get the taste that you would using anything else. It, it gets seasoned over time. So you could make like, uh, you could actually, you could make home fries. What my dad does, makes home fries, just lightly sautés the sausage real quick and puts it in because it's all gonna cook together. And then he actually cracks raw eggs on top. And then you pop it in the oven for like 15 minutes with like some sprinkled cheese on it. Uh, you know, like uh, American cheese out of the packaged cheddar. And it's absolutely unbelievable. 
good breakfast idea for you. I mean, so these pots could get really expensive, as you can see, $150, $183. But you have to be careful with the expensive nonstick pots because if you're spending that much money on them, you better make sure the people in the house know how to use them. I was just recently in Target and I, I heard that the, the air fryers are something I really got to get on top of as well. So this is just gives you an idea of what some of the top of the line coffee makers can go for. You know, you see these in movies a lot in, in like people's houses. I think I was just watching a movie that just came out about uh, Westfield, New Jersey, uh, about a haunted house there or a very weird neighborhood. And it's called The Watcher. He had something like this. So these go for like $1,100. But you can make espresso and steam your own milk. Of course, they could keep going up into the 2000s. These might be air fryers. Uh, it is an air fryer and a toaster. I was told that they do come with combinations. And it's not even that bad. It's stainless steel. It's 230 bucks, up to 450 if you have like the more eclectic uh, bronze or copper fixtures, if you have like a Viking stove in your kitchen, I mean, this will fit right in. It would be amazing if they had like a, an oven, a toaster oven, air fryer, microwave combo. I'm sure they're working on it. But I'm glad we ran into that. Really great store. I highly recommend you guys stop in here if you can one day. So it's baking goods, spoons. Really cool uh, various wooden spoon display here. Selection. Again, another, another table with a bench concept these are cool we used to go to an italian restaurant all the time and they used to bring the salad out in a wooden bowl and i bought a cheap one at restaurant depot and it cracked i had a lot of weight in it i guess and as soon as i picked it up there was a crack already but this thing is solid it's probably like olive wood or that might be the wood right there 50 bucks well worth it it's a nice presentation putting you know a salad in a wood bowl bringing it to the table Here's, this, here's a cool look. This is it in white now. And all these signs say 20% off. This is not bad, $12.99. Nice table. These chairs are, ah, so the chairs are separate. They're $4.19 each. They seem like they're really comfortable though. Here's the hutch that goes with that. It's a sideboard. It's fifteen hundred. Uh, do these open? Yes. You push them in, and these open up. Nice hinges on there. Feels really heavy. Good so Good wood. Placemats here. Pretty much any placemat you could think of. And uh, oh, here's a wooden version. That's cool. Blue stripe mat. There's no name on it, but we're getting into some Christmas decorations here. This is actually a real pine, I think. If it isn't, I'm. No, it's not. That's incredible. It looks so real. That's the realest artificial tree I've ever seen. A potted six foot cypress tree for 500. Can't even tell the difference. Amazing. Speaking of Beetlejuice, you got some more of her her, her artwork here a little bit. <laughs> it's kind of like an Aztec theme. Check out these huge baskets. I wonder how much these go for. I love how there's like no prices on things. Some, oh, here we go on the bottom. Here. 119 well worth it that was a nice basket you have your black nutcrackers here 
Really nice fireplace um, grill for the front for sparks. Some more wreaths, cranberry. Oh, here we go. Got some cool jack-o'-lanterns here, $40. The, the inside's painted orange. It really gives it a really interesting look. Really modern, classy. Some more decorations here for, you know, if you're putting together a wreath or this flower display. A ton of, a ton of pots and somebody just broke something. It sounded expensive. Wow, this is, look at these punch bowls. It's like 69 bucks, $100. Not too expensive, I was thinking it was gonna say 200. I thought these were like pizza boards, but I think they're just serving boards. Just pretty much any type of gorgeous wood you could think of as a serving platter. This is a split in the wood and then they put some supports on there. It's a really cool look. I just wanted to show you guys these trees. Their trees here are of the highest quality. This looks absolutely real. It's really unbelievable. Here's all your Christmas stockings and cozy little blankets and bags. I saw a price tag here. Just be on it but I'm sure that that's upwards of a thousand dollars it has the integrated lights sixty dollar for the star on top just trying to find a price tag for that I don't see anything it's a really cool star up there though But again, look at the decor in here alone. I mean, look at these skylights, it's awesome. So here in this back area, it's just everything related to drinks and mostly drinks and wine, punch bowls, wine chillers. Like if you need it, it's here. Corking devices, wine chillers, wine racks, every type of wine glass you could think of. This is a, that is some red wine glass right there. I haven't seen that at some of the best restaurants I've been to. It's awesome. Margarita glasses, coasters. Got some nice shakers here. Martini glasses. Another cool table. Yukon, this is called. 16. 1600 and the chairs are 399. Well, here is your carbonation. 
appliances, if you will, 229. Wine champagne bucket, that's for chilling. Your strainers, muddlers. Shot glasses, half shot, full shot. Crystal shaker, that's cool. I haven't seen this many in many places. 20 bucks, not bad. More punch bowls. Let's check out upstairs. This like it's like for your scotch if you're like a big time lawyer or something you could put your blue label in there. No, I still have never had one of those. Really neat store, clean displays look great. Huge, there's huge paintings over here. It actually is an escalator, as you can see, and we're gonna probably be going up to the furniture area next. Lighting, tables. So, isn't that pretty? Pretty store there. Another large black, this is called Verge. Definitely the best selection of dining room tables I've seen. Really nice leather couch. It looks very comfortable. I bought one of these tables. They're so handy because they they go underneath the couch. Crate and bar um, the container store has one as well. This one's two hundred and fifty dollars. You can get a really good one at the container store. In multiple colors for like fifty bucks. Um, this couch is 3000 it's real leather. I think it's a little too expensive though. It didn't feel like, like super high grade leather to me. This is like mostly beds. Uh, oh, check out these chairs, guys. These are cool. Beds here ton of couches this store is definitely my style it's like clean whites and wood and not not fancy like a little country very modern that goes with wood floors it's exactly what I'm looking for so if you guys haven't come here definitely try to check it out oh cool here's a desk for uh The chair alone is $850. Just wanna sit, just wanna sit in an $850 chair. Not bad, very nice. <laughs> See how much this desk is. $27.99, it's a walnut executive desk. It has the dovetails. Cool desk, very nice. You have some centerpieces here. I we actually had this in a condo that we were we were listing. I don't see the price of that piece there. It's like a jack or something. Large block. Oh, it's like less than a hundred bucks. Some cute little kiwis here. It's awesome. cool setup here the darker leather with the cloth couch and the dark coffee table with side tables so for this entire ensemble here you're probably talking that was 2000 right there this is 800 for this These chairs are 2,500 each. That's wild. 
and the couch is 2,000. So two, four, 10 grand for what you're looking at. And that's not counting the wood and shelving. I'm sure the rug is like 800 as well. A little pricey in here. You could definitely get really cheap rugs at like home, home sense. I did a video on that. Try not to ever go over three or 400 for a rug. Shop around, check out home sense, target. You know, if it's not something that's being walked on constantly and it's just like an area rug, you don't have to spend $2,000. There's some kids' furniture here. Dollhouses, small beds. But that's basically it, guys. I just wanted to show you up here. It's just all furniture and pillows, throw pillows, sheets, bookcases. Really nice store. Definitely try to stop by.